with a father who's had a pretty hard time lately containing his excitement on TV. Dave Benz alongside Jim Peterson. Jim, the Timberwolves, their bench has been near the bottom of the league all season in terms of production as you have a visitor. He didn't realize I had all this adrenaline pumping and I wanted to just get him off me and I was kind of just trying to nudge him, but I bowed him in his stomach and I got him good. I got him as good as I got any player in the history of the NBA in my career. It was one of those moments where I just was super amped. And for good reason. Moments before Jim Peterson was prepping to call the Wolves jazz game, this happened. His stepson, Sanjay Lumpkin and the Northwestern Wildcats beat Michigan in dramatic fashion, likely punching their first ticket ever to the NCAA tournament. My phone is in my hand and it starts buzzing. I had 11 text messages in about 10 seconds. And so I knew that they win. And so then before we got on camera, I know the guys in the truck are, are watching, you know, on the camera. So I get up and I'm like, yes. An emotional Peterson then went from play-by-play -play announcer to proud dad all on live TV. My son's Northwestern team is going to go to the NCAA tournament for all intents and purposes for the first time in their school history, so I'm just over the moon right now. That feeling then continued Sunday when Peterson was on hand for Sanjay's senior day. They had all the big heads, his freshman year, sophomore, so all the five faces of Sanjay. You know, he just got a lot of love. I would give you tears right now. I, I, I was crying before the game. Even before when Coach Collins was talking about it, I think I used up all my tears. And more tears of joy likely on the way when Peterson, who recently stepped down as an assistant coach for the Lynx to spend more time with his family, travels to see Sanjay make history. Wherever they're going to be, I don't care if it's Buffalo or Utah, I'll have to miss a Wolves game if I have to, um, to be at this historic game for Northwestern.